know is if I won, I would give Portia and Byron so my, I. my dinner. Um, I'm thinking no. Because <laughs> Byron's ass got a night off and he's watching TV. He'll he's be doing fine. He's in a hospital. He's in a hospital, he's in a hospital fighting for his life. He's not f fighting for his life. You are so How dramatic. You know? Why would you say that? Like, why would you say that right in front of Portia? At that point, I had to call her out. I was like, you know what? She doesn't genuinely care about anybody else's problems. I ain't gonna let you get away with that. I'm gonna shut you up. Yeah. I'm gonna say one thing that I had a problem with today. Okay. And I'll tell it right to your face okay. right now, okay? When we're sitting over there, and everything just happened with Byron, and Jim and Elizabeth are talking about, like, what was the first thing that came to your mind? And your first thought was like, well, I was thinking about Marlon. He went through a lot of death. And I was like, that was the most selfish thing I heard you say. No. Me thinking about my husband is selfish, and this really backwards. It was because, you, like, Byron at that was, point, at you that weren't point, thinking of Byron. Byron. Like, it was all about Byron. We're all talking about Byron. But I you don't said give it a what how you interpreted it. No, no, I'm, I'm telling, telling you what husband. you said. What you said. Not how I interpreted it. For you to judge me because I'm not I'm judging you. About I'm not husband. judging you. What, what I'm you saying to you is, that was it's, the most selfish thing I I've heard you I have an opinion. It sounded selfish. Am I the only person who interpreted that as selfishness? I didn't interpret that as the same. My bad.